Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Wednesday night. It's Best of the Fest Sydney Comedy Festival Super Show. Put your hands together and welcome to the stage your host, Bart Freeman. <laughs> All right. That is some good Wednesday night energy. Some people really holding it up and other people like, I'll be checking my phone. <laughs> All right, we're out Wednesday night, good energy, comedy. Who's been to these shows before? Make some noise. <laughs> Excellent. Also, this is getting streamed on TikTok. What? What's up, TikTok? Woo! <laughs> like, 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 like. Yeah. You're just like this. <sighs> that's, that's, that's you guys. Anyway, um, it is good to be out, isn't it? It has been a crazy couple of years. My job as a host is to get you pumped up, by the way, and tick that off the list. You guys are fucking out of control. <laughs> <laughs> This, this is the right energy that I would want from any crowd. Just like, what have you got, fuckhead? This is... It doesn't... I can't... Generally can't get an audience more pumped than this. Someone will be like, let's fucking do this! And Aussies will be like, nah, get fucked. I, I paid money for this. You fucking do this. I'm just going to sit in the darkness and judge you like a lazy Batman. Uh, I think, uh, you know, as you get older, it's harder to get excited. It still happens. People try. It doesn't always work to get your pump, people are like, mate, you excited for holidays? You're like, see what happens when we get there. <laughs> she can be fucked. I think it's very hard as an adult to get properly excited, unless there's drugs involved. Then, uh, <laughs> fuck, then you get excited about anything, don't you? <laughs> hey, mate, we're going to the shops. I fucking love the shops! <laughs> mate, you excited for Christmas? Yes. Are you on meth? Yes. No sleeps till Christmas! <laughs> We'll do a test, uh, we'll do a proper test. Who genuinely in their heart of hearts got excited for Easter? Correct, that is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Not a single soul. And I was like, fucking what? I asked that leading up to Easter because I was curious. I got very few people, no one, really, just a couple. The best one, a lady put up a hand and said, what's Easter? I was like, fuck, I thought Easter was pretty common. She had an accent. I was like, where are you? From, she said, Israel. I was like, you guys fucking started Easter. <laughs> um, the other good response I had, I was like, who's pumped for Easter? A dude put his hand up and was like, hot cross buns. <laughs> so I'm like, they're good. He's like, they're fucking good. <laughs> they are good. They're not just Easter now, are they? Hot cross buns are kind of spread across the calendar, haven't they? They're kind of the cane toad of the baked good world. <laughs> just pop up in November. You're like, get back to Easter. I love them. I think uh, the best way to have them is toasted with butter. Can we agree? Yes. Yeah, this is the passion I was looking for. Uh, yes! They're thick boys though, you know. You should use the grill in the oven. I don't. I'm not a chef. I make the toast at work. <laughs> and there's a bit of violence in that. So look at the toaster going, hey mate, we've got hot cross bun. The toaster's like, mm, I don't know. And you're like, this is fucking happening. And then you're like, get the fuck get in there, you fuck. Get the f it's like trying to pat a cat through a letterbox. Just get the fuck. You lo it's, it's in there. You lower the lever. Nothing lowers. It's fucking in. <laughs> and you're like, I'm no chef, but I reckon that'll fucking toast. <laughs> no, that, that'll toast. You turn away. You wipe down the bench. You turn back. Smoke's rising out. <laughs> you're like, <coughs> no, it's toasting. <laughs> it pops. Nothing pops. You look in, the toaster's like, I fucking told you so. And you're like, shut up. You gotta do what any sensible adult would do now, because you're in a, you know, a predicament. So you do what any sensible adult would do. You get a knife. <laughs> Out of the drawer. <laughs> a few people nodding, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're about to go in on that, then you're like, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I could die. And I won't come back like he did. <laughs> Maybe that's why they made hot cross buns. <laughs> to teach us about his journey. <laughs> Namaste. <laughs> um, I don't think Easter's for us, I think it's for kids. My nephew's six and he's so excited every, day, every week leading up. He had, he's had a plan, he had a plan. He was so, because chocolate, like he doesn't have a credit card, he can't get it. It's a big, it's a big time of the year, he can get a store that'll last him for months, right? And he was like, yeah, the Easter Bunny's coming. He's got chocolate eggs. He hides them. Not very good. We're going to eat chocolate eggs. He was so excited. So cute. He's so excited. So cute. He still believes in the Easter Bunny, you know. But most of you probably don't even believe in yourselves. <laughs> Fuck. 
Fucking gotcha. Fucking gotcha. Decent laugh there. That was good. Most people took that as a joke. But there's a few quiet people in the audience going, mm, he's right. It's been a tough year. I just came out for a giggle. It's been a tough couple of years. Um, COVID's been around. Make some noise if you've already had COVID. Good energy, good. There's a bit of no long COVID there. Maybe a little bit of brain fog, but you're back. Make some noise if you haven't had it yet. Tonight could be your night, motherfuckers. Why, well, you think you're better than us? There's a doorknob with your name on it. It's fucking coming. Just risking it. Just like, maybe I'm immune. Nah, you're fucking not. I, I thought I was. I got it at the end of March and I felt like I'd lost a two-year game of tag. <laughs> Go to your room for a week. All right, I'll lie so. And now I've just been out in the city just licking surfaces, being like, suck my dick, COVID! I'm immune! It's been a while, a couple of years. Some people went down the rabbit hole. My, my brother was one of them. He... Oh, he fucking went, he went mental. Like, full conspiracy, right? Like, he called me height of fear in 2020. Was like, bro, fuck, man, fucking dude, fuck. fuck it's fucking, it's the fucking government, man. It's the fucking government, dude. They're fucking taking over. It's like, man, I, I think they're already in charge. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what they do. That's why I elected they, we elected them, because, I mean, I don't want to do the roads. I don't want to be in charge. <laughs> he was like, nah, stop fucking around. This is serious, dude. It's the fucking government. Think about it. They're fucking tracking us. They're going cashless. It's the fucking government. I was like, yeah, man, you're right. The, it is the government. They've actually employed me to watch you. He was like, fuck, 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 fuck. He hung up. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't called back. So if you've seen him, let me know. I've got to get a chip in that cunt, quick smart. <laughs> um, so. Some people went to lengths to not get the vax. I think most of us did. Good job. Some people didn't want to do it. I don't know if you heard there was a, a story in Melbourne. A, a Melbourne man, a homeless dude, was offering a service for 50 bucks, right? You could give him your Medicare card and he would go in and get the shot for you. <laughs> so you could get on that fucking oh, vax register. He got over 50 shots before they caught that wild dog. Um, two and a half grand, good cash. Um, he's fine. Uh, hasn't got COVID yet, crazily. No idea why. But uh, he's actually, recently he's doing really good. He recently got a job. He's, he's working for Telstra as a 5G tower. Think about it. Look into it. Who stands to gain? I don't know. It's gone long enough now that I think, like, I am sexually objectifying hand sanitizer dispenser. <laughs> All the dispensers. I'm just... I mean, I can't... I don't want to, but I can't help it. Like, you go up to one of the towers and you do the... Well, well, come on, let's do this, you know. <laughs> See me. Daddy's here. And then you get the... Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> Or as I like to call it, robot cum noise. <laughs> and then you're like, fuck, dude, that's a big load. Whoa, that's, whoa, that's going down to my elbows. That's a double hander. I'm going to do my whole arm. <laughs> Woo! How many you got in you? Mm -ah, mm -ah, mm, this robot keeps coming. Mm -ah, mm -ah. Oh, no, you're empty. It's been, uh, it's been a big day. You have a rest. <laughs> it's... <laughs> It's gone, it's been going for a while. We've all become hand sanitizer sommeliers to an extent, I think. Each load, you kind of judge, don't you? It is a load, it is a load. It does come out, it does. You went to not enough and you're like, what the fuck, you don't like me? I'm not pretty enough, what's going on? I'm gonna need heaps. But I, you get it and you're like, oh, that's instantly, you're like, that's good viscosity, I like this one. This is evaporating, this is nice. And then you're like, tea tree? Yum. <laughs> what is that? That's different. What's that? Pineapple? Oh, this is cum. Sorry, this is cum. <laughs> Get confused. You guys are so great. Uh, my job is pretty much done. You are out of control. Good crowd. We've got... Um, thank, thank you for laughing at that. <laughs> Compliments. Um, 
All, all I need to do is is uh, is done, really. Like, sit back, enjoy yourselves. We've got some amazing acts. Um, most of them are going to just be coming back to back, so I'm going to be announcing them from backstage, and and they'll kind of tag team, relay, baton, sort of thing. So you've just got to keep the round of. A re yeah, it's not. I mean, they, the mic will be here, but they might be like high five or like fist bump or like a wink. I'll be like, oh, I don't know, I fucked it. I don't know. <laughs> so all you need to do is just make sure you give them a big round of applause until the the next act gets to here. Don't. Don't sort of kind of stop clapping halfway and be like, that's enough claps for you, fuckhead. <laughs> Give him the love all the way. And I think uh, we're ready to fucking rumble. Are you guys ready to fucking do this? <laughs> awesome. Oh, so good. Let's, let's ramp it up. Let's do a little bit more. Let's bring in our first act. Welcome to the stage. Hey, whoa! 